Are you struggling in formulating your qualitative research title? Well, good news! This content is for you! Hey there loves! Welcome back to my channel! If you've just hopped into this video, welcome! I am Jean Castillo de Jesus, a public school teacher handling English and research subjects, and I will be your online research bestie. If you want to learn more about these topics, be sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell so you wouldn't miss any of my uploads. Researchers, since you liked my video on the sample quantitative research titles, I thought you would also appreciate our content today in which I will provide sample qualitative research titles for each research design. Just like in my previous video about the sample quantitative research titles, feel free to modify the research site or the participants of the study. Yes, you heard it right. We use the term participants in qualitative research, which stands for the sources of data. However, in quantitative research, we utilize the term respondents. It's not all the time that your research advisor would approve the research title that I provided in my videos because the research problem depends on the institution or the community that you belong with. Your preliminary investigation also plays a crucial part in the approval of your title. So make sure that you will be able to justify the prevalence of the research problem in your school or in your municipality, depending on the research site or setting of the study that you have chosen. Additionally, if there are some research teachers who happen to come across this video lesson, I am giving you the consent to use this video in your discussion. Here are the sample qualitative research titles. First, qualitative research design is narrative. It studies the lives of individuals and asks one or more individuals to provide stories about their lives. These are the sample research titles for narrative. Kampion ng Tanghalan, the story of Vensor Dumasig. Love wins. Stories of Homosexual Couples Stories of MPOX Patients Life of Adventure Stories of Local Travel Vloggers Forever Young at 100 Stories of Centenarians Pinagtagpo ngunit hindi tinadhana Story of Almost Married Couples Untold Stories of Kerida Working Children Stories Behind Child Labor Stories of Physically Challenged Fathers Unheard Stories of Bullying Victims The second qualitative research design is Phenomenology Researcher identifies the essence of human experience about a phenomenon as described by the participants. These are the sample research titles. Ovaries with Pearls Lived Experiences of Women with Polycystic Ovary Syndrome Lived Experiences of Teachers in Far-Flung Municipalities Sipat sa Buhay ng Mga Maniniyot Capturing the lived experiences of event photographers. Over time, lived experiences of working students. Ticket to success, delineating the work immersion experiences of students. Behind the glitz and glamour, lived experiences of pageant queens. My boy is wearing skirt. Lived experiences of fathers with gay sons. Lived experiences of student athletes. Lived experiences of teacher applicants in Northern Samar. Lioness of the household. Lived experiences of domestic workers. Next qualitative research design is case study, which entails that researcher explores in-depth a program, event, activity, process, or one or more individuals. Cases are bounded by time and activity, and researchers collect detailed information using a variety of data collection procedures over a sustained period of time. 
Here are some sample research titles for case study. Case study on bullying victims. Case study on mobile gamers. Case study about students with stage fright. Case study on grade 7 non-readers. Case study about chain smokers. Case study about children in a broken home. Case study on learners with physical disabilities. Case study on students with math anxiety. Case study on mother tongue instruction. Case study about obesity. Heading on to the next qualitative research design, ethnography. Researchers study an intact cultural group in a natural setting over a prolonged period of time by primarily collecting observational data. Let us now have the sample research titles. Exploring the learning and literacy of local volunteering by youths and adults in the Philippines, an ethnographic study. An ethnographic study for understanding children's oral health in a multicultural community. Multilingualism, an ethnographic study on Maranao school children in Sorsogon City, Philippines. Masculinities and eating practices in the Philippines, an ethnographic study. In the wake of Haiyan, an ethnographic study on gendered vulnerability and resilience as a result of climatic catastrophes in the Philippines. Parada ng Lechon in Balayan, Batangas, Philippines to honor St. John the Baptist, an ethnographic study. Culture, politics, and schools in rural Philippines, an ethnographic study of teacher community involvement. Cultural beliefs and practices of ethnic Filipinos, an ethnographic study. Landscapes of literacy, an ethnographic study of functional literacy in marginal Philippine communities. Family Literacy and Cultural Identity, an ethnographic study of a Filipino family in Canada. Lastly, we have Grounded Theory. Research derives a general, abstract theory of a process, action, or interaction grounded on the views of participants. This involves using multiple stages of data collection and the refinement and interrelationships or categories of information. You can run, but you can't hide. A grounded theory analysis of suppression among old prisoners in the Philippines. A grounded theory of Filipino wellness. Kaginhawaan. Oh my gastos! Scrutinizing the budgeting practices of senior high school students. Students. Heeding the call of greatness, corporate social responsibility practices of Allen municipal officials, employees, and communities, multi-purpose cooperative. Entrep Sagip, unpacking the motivation and attitudes of accountancy, business, and management students towards entrepreneurship. Perspectives on catch-up Fridays of junior high school students. Knowing Thyself, European Identity, Journalists' Creative Process in Newswork, a Grounded Theory Study from the Philippines, Grounded Theory on Creating and Maintaining Adult Education Programs in Selected Higher Education Institutions in the Philippines, The Process of Managing Family Financial Pressures Upon Community Reentry Among Survivors of Sex Trafficking in the Philippines, a Grounded Theory Study. That's it! for today's lesson i hope you learned a thing or two from me if i was able to help you craft your own qualitative research title give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell to keep you posted of my lessons thank you so much for watching and please do love research bye